save us. That's a great deal of money. Dang, I will. Don't give me any more. There's a good chap. The poor brain's addled with counting that loss. You have no head to think as much. That's your trouble. <laughs> head. It's not my head. It's my fingers that's the trouble. Truly, I've only got ten fingers, and I've given them the proper cramp, tapping one against another. Still more gold. <laughs> Let me see. Five. Six. Oh, dear, no, I... I've reckoned that silver piece twice. Let it be, Oh, no, which... no, no, look, now I'll have to start all over. You'll get on faster yeah. without you. Come on, no, Will. Let uh, me go. Uh, uh, leave uh, it be. You'll be all day at this rate. Oh, for the life of me, I can't think why we skulk in Sherwood Forest like outlaws. We are outlaws. Yes, but why? When we have all this gold. Why, Will Scarlet, we, we could get ourselves farms or mills or even a small castle and live the life of gentlemen. Oh. If this were shared out among us, each according to his work... Or if it is worth, then you come off badly. <laughs> And this money's not ours, you know that much. Not ours? You know what Robin Hood has always said. We take ill-gotten gold from the rich oppressors and give it to the poor and needy, and that's how it's got to be much. <laughs> poor and needy? Yeah. I'm poor, I'm needy. Look at my doublet, all torn by thorns. I could make this doublet last twice as long if I hadn't to go climbing trees and scrambling through thickets. You could not only make it last twice as long, you could make it twice as big. How? Double it. <laughs> <laughs> double what? The oh, hole. You yeah, double it. Oh. <laughs> Here oh. comes Robin Hood. <coughs> what you say is true. We better warn them. A knight, you say. Walking through the forest. He has no horse and comes alone. One of our fellows spied him. Or no men at arms or followers with him. That's strange. Maybe a trap. He may be sent by the sheriff of Nottingham. He'll never find our hiding place. Are all the guards posted? Well, night and day, I'm not afraid of that. But then they may think that we'd leap on a single night to hold him to ransom. It might be an ambush. Yes. You and I will go into this further, John. Well, boys, have we counted the money? Uh, counted it, good Robin. Much here it's so befogged his tiny brain, he's counted in the buttons on his doublet twice. <laughs> once, good will, only once. Sir. How much is that? 420 pounds in good rich gold, Robin. Good, then hide it again. Come on, Will. Out of the way, my. Come on. And fire Tuck, get some food ready. Right, Robin. John, let's go and see where this strange knight of yours has got to. Right, Robin. Keep wary. Will, you're in command till I return. All right. Hey, hey, let yes. me out. Let oh. me out. <laughs> Master Woodman. Hey, Master, you may have startled me. Oh, uh, begging your pardon. Uh, Sir Knight, I should have said. Tell me, good fellow, where can I get a horse? A horse, sir? Nay, I couldn't say there. Are no horses hereabouts, except them belonging to gentlefolk. I'm no but a poor woodcutter. Is there no habitation near? Not between Nottingham Town and St. Mary's Abbey. I'm bound for the Abbey. It's a fair step to walk, sir. Well, my horse got lost in a bog. I must reach the Abbey by midday. Or... I reckon you'll have to go back to Nottingham Town. And that's a tidy way, too, sir. Are you, um... Are you all by yourself, sir? I am. No serving men or page, like. I but now return from the Crusades, and pages are too dear a luxury. And you saw nobody when you came along? No one, until yourself. Whom do you summon? Help, sir, help. A trap. We set no traps tonight. We take precautions, that is all. Aye, necessary precautions. What do you want of me? First answer me one question. Are you a friend of Sir Guy of Gisborne? That villain. Or the Sheriff of Nottingham? These are no friends of mine. Good answers. We'll do you no harm so long as you do us no mischief. <laughs> mischief, sir. I suffer mischief. I don't do it. Let me go. I have to cover many a mile, else I lose my house and lands and everything I have. He says he has to be at St. Mary's Abbey by midday. He may be a friend of the abbot. He's no friend of ours. Yet this knight does not look like a villain. I need your help. I know not who you may be, but 
Can you help me to a horse? If I'm not at the Abbey by midday, my lands are forfeit to the Abbot. What is your name? Sir Richard at the League. And yours? Tell me your story and you may call me friend. Come with us. By my faith, that abbot has snatched more lands by usury than the harshest even of our nobles. He's bloated with money. Ill gotten, most of it. I have no money. I go to plead for longer time in which to pay. Thank God they will be merciful. The prior, he's a good man, but the abbot loves him not. Three and carry four and take away five. Oh, I'm in a sore mess now. I have to start all over again. You're hopeless. Leave it be. Fly took an aisle to it. I can count if I have time. You flurry me, that's what it is. You're as good at sums as you are at jokes, Mux. And that is impossible. <laughs> I am a very good jester. <laughs> oh, I, I'll test you as a riddle for you. How does a tailor make his coat last? <laughs> I know that one. By not wearing it. No, no. A tailor makes his coat last by making his trousers first. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no, no. Look what you've done. Now I shall have to start all over again. Oh, dear, oh, dear, oh, dear, oh. <laughs> 